Basley, good morning. It's a big day for you today. Yeah, today's your day. They're gonna check your eye, they're gonna fix it for you. Okay, look at me, you should be happy. Look, yeah, it's okay. Hey, Basley, it's all right. <laughs> Yeah, Basley, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. How you doing? How's everybody doing? I hope everybody have a great day like us today. It's a big day for us. I'm nervous. It's Papa Rug, Mama Rug. Hey, guys. We're again here with the Awadis family <laughs> and yes. Basley family. Basley. Yeah, today it's the day. And we've been talking about it for a long time. And finally, we have doctor appointment for Bosley's eye specialist. Yeah, we got we got the best doctor. I was searching and I called a couple of places that we took Bosley for regular checkup and they recommend this doctor. So I made an appointment for him. I, I am so nervous and sad. I don't know. I We have to be positive, but I just don't want to hear nothing bad about him. I hope it's going to be all good. I know you guys been praying and hoping that he'll be okay, so we'll take him to the doctor another hour. <laughs> I know. It's like, I swear. We've like, been up our... so early in the morning, I, <laughs> you know, preparing for everything and praying for Bosley. And, uh... Yeah, it's like you're taking your kid to a doctor, you're taking <laughs> yourself and you're scared the doctor might say something. So, well, let's hope for the best. and. Yeah, this is it. It's it's an eye specialist. So whatever he's gonna tell us, so and then we'll follow whatever he's gonna tell us. Uh, you know, before was everybody saying something else at the bed, every doctor saying something different. But this time, it's an eye specialist, and hopefully, hopefully, he's gonna cure him. Like if there is yeah, an eye drop or, or even surgery. Anything but eye drop. Ah, uh, oh, no I eye drop, know, but I, but I think that's the only thing to cure the eye is the eye drop. But this time, this whatever he tells us, whatever he, he's going to give us, we're going to find a way to put the damn eye. Hey, you scared? <laughs> drop. Drop yeah. in his eye. Oh, yeah. Go, go. Oh, yeah, Basley. Oh, yeah, look. Basley, we're going to go in the car, and we're going to go to the vet, and they're going to check your eye, and they're going to say, he's okay. Yay. Yay. You're okay, Basley. Look at you. <laughs> look at that piece I have taken out. It's okay. Let, leave it. That way he can I love see you. it. Give me a kiss. Woo. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Yeah. Only Brandon. Only Brandon. <laughs> oh, did Brian go... Uh, he he listen, he's where's Brian? Did you cry <laughs> for Brian? <laughs> no. You wanna go in the car now? He's a big guy, he doesn't cry anymore. Really? He doesn't cry anymore. Yeah. Okay, we're about to hit the road to the doctor. Yeah, because the doctor is like and three, four cross minutes away. finger. I hope everything's will be fine. Yeah. So think positive. Yeah? Yeah. So we'll keep updating you guys about his situations and I'm sure everybody's waiting to hear what's going on with Bosley and everybody pray for Bosley. Okay, that's how he sit and watch the driveway all day long. Who's coming in, who's going on. He's guarding the house very good. We're not worried about anything, right Bosley? Right? Did anybody come today? Anybody come today? What are you seeing? Do you see anything out there? Do you see anything out there? No? Thank you. So should I go and sleep and leave the, the garage open and everything? I'll be safe? I think so. All right, keep guarding the house. All right, big boy. All right, big boy. <laughs> All right, guys, so look what he does when we try to take him in the car. <laughs> Let's go in the car. All right, Bosley. Let's go in the car. In the car. Okay, in the car. You know where's your car at, right? All right, this is his. <laughs> so he wants to go in the car, but he has to do a couple tricks. Now. All right, Bosley. <laughs> it's time. Yay, we're going in the car. Yay. 
Yeah, it's time. Look at his car, how comfy it is. All right, look at how it is. Oh, that was easy. Yeah, today, if you just know where he's going. Bosley, that was easy. Huh? Okay, let me take off your leash. I'm going to sit next to you. So I'm going to be your hairy, hairy mama rug today. All right, you're in. Yeah. Okay, wait. Wait, Bosley, wait. Okay, all right. So, it's all yours. Uh, all right, the I'll bag is all yours. <laughs> okay. You guys, look how cute he stands and watch the cars from the window. I... <laughs> oh my god. Uh, he used to sit next to me in the front. Uh huh. <laughs> no way. No. I can't drive. He, why? He, he <laughs> jumped right in my arm. Like he, That's how they put their pets in their yeah. lap. Not him. <laughs> so he's punished. He's in the back. Uh oh, Basli. 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 Can you sit, please? Can you sit? Good boy. Good boy. Okay. No, he's going in my lap now. <laughs> Let me see. Hey, Basli. Hey. Watch the cars from this side. <laughs> Let's have a talk with Bosley. Bosley, you know where you're going? Yeah, you're in the car. We're gonna go to the doctor and they're gonna check your eye and they're gonna say he's okay. Yay! Yeah, yeah, you're gonna be okay. And then I call Brandon, he's coming to see you. Yeah, he, Brandon's coming to the house to see Bosley. Yay! Yay, Bosley! Are you happy? It doesn't look like it. No, don't cry. I think he's crying because he knows we're almost here, Ron. <laughs> look at Bosley. Yeah. So listen. Don't cry. Don't make me cry. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. Sit. Sit. Good boy. <laughs> I love you, Bosley. I love you. <laughs> okay. Okay. I think Bosley found a girlfriend at the clinic. Go, Bosley. Come here. Go. Where you go? Go. Oh. Bosley found his girl. <laughs> he's too shy. Yeah, he is. She's not. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't want to go. She wants Bosley. On that one, I'm sure. It's okay. Come here. I don't stay. You'll know how hard it is to even try to do yeah. anything. I know. Hi. Did I put that in his eye? Yeah. Oh, oh Bosley. <laughs> no. So he has a little piece of paper in his eye. Wow. Then I close the lid so it doesn't touch his eye and it's inside the the eyelid. How come you don't let and us then, put the, the eye drop then? I know, right? Okay, so that it He's tells nervous. you. Yeah, so if it's 15 or more in a minute, it's passing. Mm -hmm. So let's see what he gets in a minute. It looks like he's not going to make any tears. Well, she's going to do it, Bosley, so you better give up. Bosley, no. Oh, my God. Good boy, Bosley. You're going to go in the car. Yeah, the car. okay, okay, okay. So you're going to hurt yourself like this. I know. Wait. Wait. No. Oh. Oh, barely. I know. I got it. Uh, it's I okay. Know. Oh, look, there's your tears. This one has tears. Yeah. Wow, I wish that one was like this. Oh, look. Right away, you see the blue thing? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's, and it's it's uh, really good, but the other one, nothing. I know. I know, baby. I'm sorry. Good boy, Bosley. Good boy. We're going to go by Brandon. 
Yeah, we are. And <laughs> Brian. He oh, he's going to cry. Oh, look at and Brian, he's going to come and Look at the color. Yeah. Oh, wow, he's already good. passing. It's not even a minute yet. That's good. At least that's a good news on this one. Yeah. So I'm guessing he's, he's getting around well with that eye. Ten more seconds, baby. Oh, I'm sorry. Yay! Alright, let's take oh. it out. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. He got 19. That's good. Yeah, so 15 or more is good. So. Oh, wow. Good job, buddy. I wish we had just some on the other eye. And then let's see if he lets me. I'm going to check his eye pressure to so rule out glaucoma, okay. which is high pressures in the eyes. I'm gonna put that in there. No, it's gonna oh, uh, kind of gently tap, almost tap the eye. 13, so that's normal. 25 and less is normal. One. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. okay. Look at say you. hi. Look at Hello. you. Don't show the other eye. That's it. Hey, look at your eyes, huh? You just look at them, okay? Oh, yeah. I know, baby. Good job. Uh, that's a good job. <laughs> Let's put some steam right there. How about that? You see? Ron, watch how the doctor's going to do it. Let's see? So, show him first. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, so <laughs> going to flush all the excess stain out. So I put a drop of stain in there, but a drop is way too much. <laughs> so now I have to flush all the extra stay, out. Baby, stay. What the stain will do is if there's a scratch on the eye, it will stick to it. It also has a little anesthetic in it just to numb the eye so that this isn't quite so irritating having all this done. Because I've got a lot of mucus to flush out of this left eye. And that extra drop of anesthetic on the eye, just to make sure this doesn't irritate. Uh, so that what that does, it makes his eye nice and numb. So he just doesn't eventually will eventually settle down. It just takes a while. Basley, Brandon, Brandon's here. Brandon's okay, coming. Okay, 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 Brandon's okay. Brandon's here. Brian's coming. Yes, they are. Too many right people. Right hold on. Yeah. One, two, yeah. three. Where's Brandon? <laughs> yeah, Brandon. He cried. It's He's coming off now. Where's Brandon? Oh, good. Wow. Yay. Good boy. Good boy. Take four to five but people. Yay. Normally, you don't want to stick anything in the eye like I just did. In order to do that, I had to numb his eye. Oh, wow. So you wouldn't want to do that without his eye being numb. Can so, we get some numbing? But this is fine using, well, the numbing stuff is toxic if you keep using it over and over again. And so what I tell people is don't do what I'm doing. <laughs> the flushing is fine. What I'm doing here is fine. You, yes, and that you can do all you want. That's just saline eye wash is all that is. It's basically kind of like contact lens solution. Okay. It's, it's water with salts in it and buffer. And that doesn't hurt anyone. No, anymore. not at all. Okay. It's the same as tears, basically. Mm -hmm. So he's got a lot of scarring and a lot of blood vessels and a little bit of pigment on this eye. But believe it or not, he can still see a little bit out of the eye. It's super hazy, but he yeah. can still see something. Really? He can okay. still see that? Yeah, just a little bit. On this eye, he can see better, but he's also got blood vessels and scarring and pigment on this eye, too. So he's got the same problem in both eyes. It's just way worse on the left side. Mm -hmm. oh, boy. So he's going to have to learn how to let you give him eye medicine. Because <laughs> he's going to need it for the rest of his life. Every day. Any easier than, like, procedure? Any LASIK thing for dogs? Or? Well, for the left eye, I'm worried that he actually does need surgery. I don't know yet, but I'm worried that he will. I'm worried that medicine will not control the problem in his left eye. In his right eye, I think medicine will work great. Yeah. And I don't think there's any surgery that will help this eye as far as the tears I know, go. I know. Mm -hmm. But this eye, we may have no choice but to recommend surgery because the medicines may not work. So there's a couple things going on. I guess I'll just start with one. So he's got 
big eyelid openings. I mean, his whole eye can bulge out. And he's got this fold rubbing. So one thing we could do is we could close the eyelid down right there to make it more normal size. Mm -hmm. So it's not so big and bulgy. Okay. It's called a medial canthoplasty. We just remove the tissue in this corner and close it down permanently. So he has a more normal size opening, more almond shaped. Okay. Um, that's one thing we could do to try to protect his eyes. But that's not going to fix the problem. It's just it would help. But I have to admit, his eyelid openings aren't as bad as most pugs I see. Yeah, it's a little I'm, smaller now. I would not recommend jumping right in and doing that surgery. I would hold off. Okay. And I would see how he does with medicine first. Okay. We may find he doesn't need the eyelid surgery. Um, right about here. There's a gland below his ear. Right about here. It's a salivary gland. And the duct goes into the mouth like that. We would move that up to the eye so it goes into the eye. He still has a bunch of other salivary glands, so he doesn't need it. Um, but it, it's a way of keeping moisture in his eye. He'd still need oh, that's medicine. Like, oh, he would still. He'd need still need medicine, medicine but if the if this worked, he'd only need the medicine twice a day on that eye. But for the rest of his life. Yeah, and so yeah, the duct surgery doesn't eliminate the need for medicine. It supplements it when medicine isn't working by itself. But who will still can see with it? Yeah, the whole the point of doing the medicine is to try to fix the problem so that he doesn't go blind. Okay. If the medicine doesn't work in his left eye by itself, then we add in the surgery, again, to keep him from going blind and to keep him comfortable. And the surgery has an 85% chance that it'll work and we'll be happy with it. So for every 20 that I do, three fail, 17 work. Mm -hmm. The reason three fail is they might pull away or they might scar shut, or they might make too much saliva, more than we want. Um, but 17 out of 20, we like how they do. They do and well. And if it doesn't work, if it doesn't work, then we still have to use the medicine three times a day, and we're no better off than we were before surgery. Um, so, mm. I, if this were my dog, and if I could afford it, I would try the medicine first, and if he didn't get better in his left eye, at least significantly better, then I would do the surgery too, but only in the left eye. The right eye doesn't need that yeah. surgery. Mm -hmm. The eyelid surgery I was telling you about, I'm not even 100% sure if he needs that, so that I would hold off on yeah. and we'll wait and see. So how much can he see on the left one, you think? Uh, I think he can see movement, shapes, shadows, light and dark, but no detail. But so if so he, if he closed, closed his right eye... Yeah, he wouldn't know who you were unless oh. you spoke. Oh. Yeah. He might not even know you're sitting there unless you moved. Yeah, I do that with Honestly. my finger next but, to his left. But with, he his, doesn't sound speaking his, but with his right eye, he can see fairly well. Not perfect, but fairly well. But I think we can make that better. Yeah, yeah but with the the make your eye better. Yeah, so we'll try this. Now there is another option. I'm not recommending this. I, if the medicines won't control the tears in the left eye, I recommend that surgery. But I've had some people say, well, can't we just remove the eye if it isn't getting better? And, you, and they're right, you can. And it's not wrong to do that. That is the quickest, easiest way to make them comfortable. I just hate removing an eye that can see. I would rather try to fix it. Oh, we'll try everything. So I hope yeah. we won't get to that stage, but if we do, Okay, as you guys watched and see what the doctor said, now it's up to us to make a decision on Bosley. So me and Ron decided to, <clears throat> we'll talk to Brandon and Brian, we'll get them here and talk about what the doctor said and the options. The good thing is he said it's not now the surgery that he need, maybe in the future. But we have to keep putting, where's the medication? Um. We have to do the medicine for a month. And if it doesn't work, then there's the surgery. <laughs> he gave us three, three, uh, four kind of medication okay, actually. Where's the eyebrows? Oh. They put them over here. So yeah. two kind of eye drops and then um, it's like a lotion, like little uh, 
So it's the three Four, things. Five, three things you have to put them in his eye. Both eye actually. Um, the good news is that the the right eye is it's good. It's good, but still we have to um, use medicine. That way it doesn't go bad as the left one. But the left one, he said it's um, it's not damaged. It's not bad, but he he cannot see hundred percent. But he can see like. You know, like shadow, shape or, shape and shadow. or something like people when people move, but he's not. He can say hundred percent. But still, we have to use the medicine that way. It'll stay that way before it gets damaged. And because he's very hard to hold him and put medicine in his eye, he gave us some pills to make him a little like tired, tired and sleepy. So that way, because we really have to do it three times. This is gonna be really hard on all of us because it's so hard to put one time medicine in his eye and it's like two drop and then three drop and hey. we have to follow everything but we will do whatever it takes to make him feel better. Yeah, the, when I saw when she put that little paper in his eye and she said there is not even a drop of tear, I felt so bad. Imagine when your eyes so, so dry and didn't produce tears that's why he's always having this thing around his eye um oh the thing is i always mean ron felt guilty thinking it was our fault that happened to him and maybe we didn't take care of his eye the first thing the doctor said was genetic he said this he would get it no matter what was a genetic from his mom and dad so <laughs> But overall, it wasn't like the other doctor it told us there is no hope, we have to take his eye out. But the doctor at the end, he said, the last option, which I don't want to go even there, they have to take his eye out because it's going to be more comfortable for him. It's not going to be any problem on the, the left, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I hope we're not going to get to that stage. We're going to so, try our best. So within a month, if it doesn't work, we're gonna have no choice but surgery. Yeah, hopefully not. Yeah. So anyway, that's the update about Bosby. Uh, and he's good, he's good. Yeah, he was co <laughs> cooperated. Co <laughs> he's good, <laughs> he's good. He's tired say. now, and now we're gonna start to put yeah, we're gonna the, do first the first medicine for him. So, yeah. Um, yeah, thank you guys for the support, keep praying. And we'll, we'll update you on anything new that happens. So within a month, we're going to have to take him back to see if the medicine works or not. So let's cross our finger, the medicine works, and Basler will feel better. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for all the love and support. Been Mama Rug. And Papa Rug. Peace. And, and of course, Bosley. Bosley. Peace. <laughs>